Shalom. I'm going to start off by giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, and Kakadash. I'm going to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And Shalom to the elect, 144,000, okay, the 144, you know, the elect men, Shalom, and also um, say Shalom to the one third, you know, men, women, and children, you know, that's listening, you know, that's listening to this word. Um, now, today's lesson, I'm going to talk about lineups, tattoos. And shaving, shaving your beard, you know, that's going off. You know, it's against, it's against the scriptures, you know, because, you know, Yahweh clearly says that, you know, clearly talks about, you know, getting lineups and tattoos and shaving your head. So I'm pull a couple of scriptures and Lord willing to be edifying. Um, we'll start off with Leviticus 19 and verse 27. You shall not round the corners of your heads. You know, so that rounding, you know, that goes, you know, striking off, you know, um, um, ruining, you know, the natural line of your hair, you know, like this. You know, you see, you know, it's, it's going in a, in a circular motion, you know, that's that rounding he's talking about. And uh, neither shall thou mar the corners of thy beard. So I'm gonna look up that word mar. So you go to mar, it means to destroy, corrupt, to ruin, to decay. To be mar, be spoiled, corrupted, injured, ruined, rotted, you know, to pervert. You know, so all these, you know, we you line up your beard, you know, you destroying, you destroying the way, you know, the way that, you know, the way that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, you know, he created you like this, you know, it's, you see how it's in that circle of motions, like a moon, you know, that's that circle, that's that, um, you know, that's, that's what he's talking about, um, the round, the corners. You know, he, you know, he, he ruining, you know, the natural, his natural hairline. You know, he's corrupting it, you know, and he's striking, he's striking off, you know, he's striking, striking, he's striking his skin off because, um, you get that, them sharp, um, blades, you know, from the, um, from the clippers, you know, you know, he's striking skin off of you. And um, and even when you use the razor, you know you you striking skin off of you. That's why after you get done um, getting your lineup, you know they spray you with that alcohol and it burns. You know because they they opening you up. And um, you know that's clearly against the scriptures. And I'm gonna pull another precept. Leviticus twenty. One in verse five, thou shalt not make baldness upon their head, neither shall they shave off the corners of thy beard. You know, so we ain't supposed to be shaving off the corners of our beards. You know, we supposed to have, you know, we supposed to have hair on our face. You know, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. You know, He created us, He created us to have hair on our face. You know, if He didn't want us to have hair on our face, then why? You know, why when you shave, you know, your hair grows back in three days. You know, sometimes, you know, some brothers a little longer, a week. But, you know, if he didn't attend, attend, attend for us to have hair on our face, you know, he would have made us like that, you know? You know, just getting, you know, just step, I mean, you know, and back in the world, you know, I was getting lineups. And, but you know now I look back at it and I see somebody with line up. You know, it look it looks feminine. You know, it, it don't look masculine. It don't look manly at all. You know, how about Shimmy I was shy. You know, he created us. He created us to be man, to be manly. You know, like the, see the lion. He got um, hair on his face. 
you know, the, how do how, how you know the difference between a male lion and a female lion? Because the male lion, you know, he got hair on his face. So, you know, that's just the, that's the animal world. And, you know, that's how, that's how, how Bashima was trying to create us to be, you know, man, manly. So I can get oh um I'm gonna read Leviticus nineteen and twenty eight so I can um you shall not make any cuttings in your in your flesh for the dead you know so you know we ain't supposed to be making any cuts in our flesh for the dead you know no R I P mom no R I P um, cousin Pookie you know not supposed to be making no tattoos for the dead, you know? No RIPs on, on, on your on your skin, you know? Um, you know, so we're not supposed to be making any, getting any tattoos. And, you know, if you do got tattoos and now you hear, you run into this word, you know, you're supposed to repent. You know, you're supposed to repent. You're supposed to, you're supposed to, you're supposed to turn away from the from the ways that we was doing while we was in the world, you know, you know, I'm a brother. I got I got quite a bit of um, tattoos, but once I knew it was going off, you know, I turned away from getting those, you know, nor print any marks upon you. I am the Lord, you know. So you know, we ain't supposed to be getting tattoos, you know. We ain't supposed to be, we ain't supposed to be getting, you know, making any cuttings into our flesh, you know, no tribal tattoos, you know, because, you know, the tattoos, you know, that goes back to the heathen customs, you know. Our ancestors, we, we wasn't getting tattoos, walking around with tattoos on our face, you know. That's the way of the heathens, you know, like the, um, the Africans and the um, Samoans, you know, with them tribal tattoos, you know. Um, let me get First Peter chapter 2 and verse 9 but ye are a chosen generation a royal priesthood a holy nation you know so you know the nation Israel we're a chosen generation you know we, we're royal people a holy nation, you know, so that means separate, peculiar people that, that ye sh show forth the praises of him who hath called you out of darkness into his marvelous light, you know, so that darkness, you know, that darkness is sin, you know, you know that's turned away from, you know, the customers of this world, you know, like getting tattoos, um, Celebrating these wicked holidays, you know, Halloween, Christmas, Thanksgiving, so-called New Year's, July Fourth. You know, we 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 supposed to we supposed to um we supposed to come out that darkness, you know, and turn into His marvelous light. You know that marvelous light. You know that's the that's the um the statues, you know, the law, you know, because the law, you know, the law is life. You know, so you know you, you know so we we supposed to be we know we we're a chosen generation you know so you know we're not supposed to be doing what these other nations are supposed to we you know what these other nations are doing you know because these other nations they was not given the law statutes and commandments you know it's only a nation of Israel the so called blacks Hispanics and Native Americans along with the confusion of faces. You know, we was only ones given the laws and statutes and commandments. So you know, you, you let the, let these let these other nations, you know, these other heathens, you know, let them, you know, let them get tattoos, you know, let them get lineups, you know. But, um, I'm gonna get one more scripture. Lord willing, it'll be edifying. We get Jeremiah chapter 10, 
verse 2. Thus saith the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen. You know, learn not the ways of these of the heathens. You know, not celebrating, you know, these pagan holidays. You know, your Christmas, Thanksgiving, um, Halloween, July 4th. Um, you know, not eating these abominable foods. You know, like pork, shrimp, lobster, crab. You know, shellfish. Um, you know, ham. Catfish. You know, we're not supposed to learn the ways of these heathens. Getting tattoos. Getting these um, R.I.P. Pookie. R.I.P. Mom. You know, we're we, we not supposed to be getting, we're not supposed to be doing what these other nations do. You know, we put, that's why we, we set apart. We're a holy, holy nation, you know. So, um, you know, that was pretty much the point on Jeremiah 10 and 2. Learn, learn not the ways of the heathens, you know. So, um, you know, that was a short lesson. And Lord willing to be edifying, you know, I just wanted to get on the topic of lineups, you know, tattoos, you know, and shaving your beard, you know, because, you know, there's people, you know, that's coming, just coming to the truth, you know, that, that didn't know it. And, you know, it's, it's brothers out there that claim they're Israelites, you know, and they still getting lineups and still shaving their beards. So um, I just want to touch on this, on this topic. Lord willing, this is edifying. I'm going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakakadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone for teaching me this truth. And Shalom to the elect, the 144K men, along with the one third men, women, and children. To the next lesson, Shalom.